In this video, I'll show you how to create shortcuts on your iPhone. If you found this guide useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, then please consider leaving a like. And let's get right into this guide. Firstly, you'll need to go and open the shortcuts app. So it should be by default on the second page here, but you can always go and search your phone for it by just dragging down on your phone like so, or going to the app library and going and searching for it as well. If you think you may have deleted the shortcuts app, then you can always go and open up the app store as well, and then go and search for shortcuts just like so and then it should appear right at the top. Here it is, you can go and download it and open it up. So once you go and open it up, then all you want to do is make sure shortcuts is selected in the bottom left and then go and tap on all shortcuts and here we are. So to go and create one, all you need to do is go to the top right and tap on this plus button like this. Now what we can do is go and set this shortcut up. Now there are so many different types of shortcuts you can do. In this case, I want to go and create a shortcut, which is basically gonna allow me to change the app icon. So firstly, you need to go and tap on add action like so, and then you'll get this menu here, and there are so many different types of categories and apps we can go and use. But in this case, I want to go and search open app like this, and then go and tap on open app, this third option here, like so. So now basically we're creating a timeline of processes. So you could go and add more processes, but I'm just gonna have the open app one uh, because I'm just creating a shortcut for another app. But as I said before, there are so many things you can do with this. Then what you need to do is choose the app you want to go and open with this shortcut. To do that, tap on the box which says app in faint blue, just like so, and then you can go and choose the app you want to do this for. In this case, I'm gonna do it for the app store, so I'll tap on app store. Then what you need to do is go to the top to where it says open app. And what we need to do is go and create the name for this shortcut. So go and tap on that there and then tap on rename. And I'm gonna go and name this app store because that's what I want the shortcut to be. Once you finish, then press done in the bottom right. And then what you need to do is tap on that downwards arrow to the right of app store like this. And you need to go and tap on add to home screen like that. Then you can go and see the preview, but what you need to do is come below that where it says home screen name and icon, and then go and tap on the icon on the left hand side. And as you can see, we've got three different options, take photo, choose photo, and choose file. So now what we need to do is go and get a photo or an icon uh, to go and choose that for. So go and open up a web browser, I'll probably use Safari, and then what you want to do is just go and search for the icon you want. And I just went and searched for App Store app icon because that's a shortcut I was creating. But you could also go and add the aesthetic you want, for example, like old or, you know, add anything basically, and then scroll down to see one you like. So in this case, I quite like this brown one here. So I'm gonna go and tap on it like so, and then I need to save this to my camera roll. And then hold your finger on the photo like so, and it should take a moment, and then we can go and tap on save to photos like so. And now we can go back to the shortcut app like this and then go and tap on the current app icon on the left hand side and tap on choose photo and your camera roll will open and then go and choose the icon that we just saved by tapping on it like so and then what you can do is go and tap on choose in the bottom right just like that and there it is then you can go to the top right and press add and we've now gone and added the app to our home screen as you can see there it says app store and let's go and drag it onto my home screen because that's where I'd want it to be and it's that easy we've now gone and created a shortcut for the app store and I could go and hide the main app store app by holding my finger on it, press remove app, and I can just hide it from my home screen like so. It's still on my phone, it's in my app library, and yeah, I can op open up the app store by pressing there, just like so. If you decide you want the original app store back, then swipe across to get your app library, and go and look for app store, you can go and search for it as well. Here it is, then hold your finger on the app itself, and then you can go and tap on add to home screen like so, and here it is back on my phone. And then you can go and delete this as well. If you guys found this useful, please consider leaving a like. Peace.